I decided to take the push up, uh, multi push up because it's small. Um, I might be picking up a lot of dogs. <laughs> and I'm wearing this instead of the other strap because this one is wipeable. Um, I think most of this is wipeable except for this little section. And if it, if it looks like I'm gonna get it dirty because I'm picking up too many dogs or whatever, then I'm just gonna flip that over and I think it'll be fine. Um, but I wore this all throughout, like during my Hawaii trip. It was so convenient. Good morning, everyone. So we're so excited. It is four o'clock in the morning. And in about an hour, we're gonna take off to get our new addition to our family. This is, but those of you who don't know, this is our miniature poodle, Boomer. We've, he is 12 years old as of April 6th. And he is the love of our lives. And actually, we used to have another dog um, who passed away. Uh, anyway, um, so we hadn't, we like having two dogs. We love poodles because my husband is highly allergic to so many things and my children are too. So we have to have non-shedding dog and Boomer has been the love of our lives. And we were not planning to get a puppy this year, but given that we're stuck at home and all of our trips are canceled, we thought this is as good of a time as any to, to get a new addition to our family and train him to be as perfect as Boomer is. Oh my God, he's so cute, look at him. Look at him. Yeah. So we're so looking forward to this new puppy though. And he's gonna, I think Boomer's gonna, I hope, I hope Boomer, Boomer's gonna love him. Okay, so I'm all ready to go. I have packed my lunch, yes. Because we don't wanna waste time and stop at restaurants to, to eat. Um, so we're packing everything. I'm drinking my coffee from my poodle mug. I, I love this mug. This is a mug that I use every single morning for coffee. Um, but I wanna to talk to you guys about something that those of you who are like saying, you know, you should have adopted, there are so many dogs that need homes. I know it, I know it because I volunteered at a shelter for several years. It was heartbreaking. And, um, but that said, I, we were looking for a poodle mix or uh, we like poodles. Um, that is non-shedding, small size, either a puppy or a young adult because I, I, I don't think I could handle back-to-back um, -back loss of, of, of pets. Um, it was very, very hard for me when, when Zoe died and so I didn't want an older dog because Boomer is older. So uh, we did look. Every time I, we get a puppy, uh, we get a new dog, we always look at shelters first and see if we can find a dog. And, but I have to tell you, any non-shedding small breed that is young are gone like that. And every time I, I would you know, try to find out if a puppy was available that I see online, they were not. And then this puppy just happened to come along from actually from Boomer's breeder. Um, she was getting a dog, a puppy from her friend, and her friend happened to have a, have one that wasn't taken yet, and so we just said sure. <laughs> so, so Debbie uh, brought the uh, puppies, the two puppies, back to her house, and we're going up to her house to pick it up. We're so excited! I get to see Debbie. I haven't seen Debbie in a long, long time. She's a lovely lady. Okay, I wanted to show you this setup that we have. We bought those pens, we got a new area rug, which we hadn't had any rugs in our house because my last dog I had, had was incontinent for 12 years. So I got rid of every carpet, every fabric um, furniture, except for the one in our living room where we never go into a living room anyway. Um, and so we got this area rug for this puppy so that we can sit on the floor and play with him. We got the pen, which we never had with any of our other dogs um, because I wanted the puppy to be safe and, and where I don't, if I had to cook, or I don't really cook, but if I had to warm up something, I don't have to worry about him getting into trouble so I can be in the pen while I, until he's completely trained. Um, oh my God, I'm so excited. My husband put like cardboard boxes in front of our TV so that the puppy can get, can't get to the, um, to the cords. 
So he's puppy proof this room, this house. Okay, I want to show you what I'm taking. Okay. Okay, these are the bags that I'm taking. I'm going to wear this, which is my multi pochette. See? With the strap from my Pochette Matisse reverse monogram bag, which I no longer have, but I still have the strap. Um, and in here, I have. It's, it's pretty empty in the front, just just like my wipes and this chain, which belongs to the, the little, this pouch, but I don't like to have it flapping around because it makes a lot of noise. And then I'm gonna put my phone in there. It's making too much noise, right? I have my, Zo in the main compartment, I have my Zoe wallet. I have my clay with my car keys and my driver's license and my card case, card coin case, I think that's what it's called, and a little pouch with my pen and uh, eyeliner because it'll get smudged over the many hours that it will be traveling, driving, and a milk lipstick, which I think you could also just as, use as a blush too, and, and it, it's like you, I put it all over my face, like just to highlight, but I love this color. It's, I got this for free for my birthday. Um, and then here I am carrying a gift for Debbie. She was so kind to pick them up for me. Um, water bowl, dog water bowl, collapsible. Um, I think this has like, um, oh, it fell off. It has like lotions and another lipstick and pen and things like that. I don't know, I'm carrying that. And then I have this is the, what is it called? Hand sanitizer. I got it when I traveled to China, which was a while ago. I wonder if it's still good. I think it's good. I don't know. Kleenex. And in my car, I have, because we were driving, in my car, I have the, the Clorox wipes. We're gonna wear a mask. We're not gonna go in t inside our house. So, you know, this is gonna be very different than any other times, but it is the times that we live in now. Okay, I'm gonna go get some coffee. Hello. Hello. Hi. I, to the back. <laughs> I was like, why are the dogs barking? No, because we were going to the back. I, I thought we should stay outside. Well, we are. We're gonna go on the back porch. We're okay. Go All right. Through. Go through it. We're okay. Going straight through. Hi. Oh, hi. We're not hi. gonna. <laughs> this is for you. This is for you. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Okay, I will. I will. I will. Oh my god, he's so cute. Oh, Boomer likes him. Yeah. Look at his tail wagging. Boomer. Oh, yeah. He's hey, totally a red dog. Boy. Hey, silly boy. Come here. Yay. Come here. Yay. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Come on, Boomer. Hello, Boomer. Yay. What a good boy. What a good boy. You're such a good boy. 
Yes, we love you the best. We do, we do, we do, we do. We do. Boomer, come on, Boomer. Yay. <laughs> I will. 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 Who's walking who? I don't know, but Boomer's being so nice. Boomer's being a nice... Toki's walking Boomer. Toki, sit. Yes. Toki, down. Yes. Toki, stand. Yes. Toki. Twirl. Oops. Twirl. Yes. One more time. Shall we do it one more time? Ready? Ready? Puppy. Okay. And just blings. Ready? Twirl. Yes. One more time. Puppy. Twirl. Yes. Good job. That's a pretty twirl. Yes. Oh, what's that noise? There you go. Yes. Now we're gonna put them in the tub. All right. Ooh, what is this? What's this? Ooh, yes. I'm gonna feed you. Ooh, you're not. You don't want to eat? Of course you do. There you go. Good boy. Good boy. Okay. Shall we start the water a little bit? Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. Are you drinking water?